This is about coming to the aid of another brother that has tasted the brutality of hatred, racism, and bigotry. In this situation, hate won't win. Mm -hmm. It will not. You didn't deserve, nor anybody deserves, to have a noose put around your neck. He had bleach poured onto him. This needs to stop. He will forgive these people for what they did. And, but he won't. And we cannot forget their actions. And hopefully this just opens up, opens up people's eyes. It's just what needs to stop, man. God damn, why are we going backwards? There are a lot of evidence of uh, 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 violent incidents that happen at these MAGA rallies. This is, this is a, essentially terrorism. And you wonder, like, how deep it goes, these hateful groups that get together or... Maybe, hopefully it's just two people, but that's what I'm afraid of, that it's going to well, go a lot I mean, deeper. Thank you for calling it terrorism because the media does not. It is. Know, it is. Yeah. It's domestic media terrorism. Not, absolutely. But I don't like that it's being put out there in the media that this is a right. possible yeah. hate crime. Right. I think that even sows a seed that makes people feel about. like, well, is he making this up? Yeah. Well, what is this about? Right. I don't like that. Like, don't put that in people's minds. This man was hurt. He was injured and he needs justice. It's the, the horrific yeah. details you know, behind the the premeditation for this attack. Yeah. They didn't find a rope, they brought a rope. Yeah. I mean, uh, we thought, we pretty much thought racism had come a long way when uh, President Barack Obama was president. But and by then, the way, it had. Yeah, it, it had, but, but so then, but then the again. hatred. Yeah. So, so if you really want to get into that, you, uh, yeah. you want to build a wall for somebody, build a wall for some of the white nationalists and supremacists. We have a media that's saying it's a debate whether or not what just happened to Jesse Smollett is a hate crime. It's absurd. This isn't a debate. There have been people in the government now who have made it okay for people to announce these hateful feelings that they have towards other people. We really need to find Well, these one of the things you and I were discussing earlier is clearly anyone who lives with this kind of hate is not terribly bright.